First of all, there's plenty of people who talk about permissive zoning ordinance. Uh, if the use is not permitted, it is prohibited. That is a law that we have enforced. And I think I may be the only one in this, in this room who has enforced it. Uh, there may be somebody for another city, but for city of San Diego, we have enforced it. We fought it to, to, to uh, enforce it. We went to the Court of Appeal, some heavy litigation. I am not afraid to enforce that law. Um, the argument is, is that rentals, not just short-term rentals, but in an RS zone, rentals are not even mentioned. And therefore, since they're not even mentioned, they should be prohibited. It's correct, they're not mentioned. Short-term vacation rentals are not mentioned. Rentals are not mentioned. And if that argument holds water, then every rental in the RS zone is committing, committing a crime. A little, little glitch in this. It doesn't mention owner-occupied either. Let that sink in a little bit. Owner-occupied units are also committing crimes, if that's true. Who's going to occupy these things? We have a lot of vacant houses in San Diego. I, I, even Aunt Emma visiting from Kansas City. Guests aren't even identified. What's going on here? Who's left to occupy these? Well, the answer is yes, you can enforce, certainly enforce, um, uh, against uh, uses that are not prohibited because they're not, they're not permitted. But you've got to look at what the zoning laws cover. In this case, an RS zone basically says it's a single housekeeping unit, a dwelling, one family. And it lists a, a, um, a one uh, unit dwelling as being permitted. Nowhere does it delve into the legal basis for them occupying the unit. It also doesn't say city attorneys can uh, occupy a unit or council members or judges because it doesn't cover that, except in very specific cases. So the permissive zoning ordinance can be used in many circumstances, but it has to fit with what is actually covered by the RS zone. The RS zone is about a dwelling unit. It doesn't say anything about the legal basis for the occupant. 